All right, guys, so here we are at the new in-game event that I mentioned in the previous video I uploaded earlier today, the Broken Hearts Day event. Um, Broken Hearts Day is uh, fast approaching in Borderlands, and Maurice of Sanctuary 3's resident, uh, Sinan and Sarion, is hoping you'll assist him with his ongoing study of the human condition as he turns his attention to our species hoarding rituals. You'll be well rewarded for com uh, completing Maurice's challenges during this new seasonal event uh, revealed on episode 5 of the Borderlands show. And don't worry, you're not go uh, going to be asked to do anything inappropriate. Simply shoot down the floating hearts that are swirling around enemies across the galaxy as you go about your regular Vault Hunter business. Uh, so obviously the hearts look something like this. The hearts take several forms and break in different ways. Some will fall to the ground with a fiery explosion while others might drop loot briefly or turn enemies into fallen allies. Wait, what? While others might drop loot, or others uh, will turn enemies into allies. Okay, that's pretty cool. Uh, for example, Maurice will keep track of how many hearts you've broken and mail you the following uh, event rewards as you reach the, of these totals. Okay, so here we go. So right here, we got 10. You get an uh, Echo Caridigum Echo Skin. Uh, the Cosmic Romance, a Weapon Trinket. Um, that's a 25. At 50, we get the Terminal... Uh, Holly Morris, a legendary Malawan SMG, dope. A Heartbreaker, which is a vault, <laughs> not the gun, guys. The it's a vault hunter skin, okay. And then this is the big one, right? So 100, uh, wedding invitation, legendary Jacobs sniper rifle. Okay, so um, whenever this event goes live, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna try uh, my best to uh, get to 100 as fast as I can. I'm gonna make a review, obviously, on this SMG. Uh, I'll probably make a video on like where to efficiently farm hearts. And stuff like that so i cannot wait um hearts will start to materialize across the borderlands once the february patch deploys before 3 p.m pacific on thursday february 13th and then you'll have one week to assist maurice uh, before the seasonal event ends at 8 59 pacific on thursday february 20th okay so that's really cool because uh, um i don't know if you guys were uh some of y'all weren't here about for the bloody harvest or not but the bloody harvest literally went on was a halloween event that went on into december uh this one's not even gonna last uh through the last week of february this one is a one week event which is nice because um i feel like some people uh, could get annoyed really fast however if you um i i do want need to point this out if you don't want to participate in this event there's going to be an actual feature for you uh in the end at the uh, main menu uh, that's going to allow you to opt out of having to participate in the event if you don't want to so uh, That is something I want to go ahead and mention uh, they mentioned that in uh, Their big uh, like big time Borderlands show a uh, video I made on it covering everything uh, literally earlier today It'll be linked at the end of the uh, video if you guys want to check that out so um, here we go and then that's basically um, Like all we really have so far for information on some of our other exciting stuff and the works. Oh, yeah uh, This is a community love letter. They wrote for us, which is pretty nice. Uh they, uh, they, they were mainly uh, talking about some of the big stuff like uh, plans for Mayhem 2.0, uh, skippable cutscenes, level cap increase, and upgrades to the Guardian Ring system. Uh, I made a video on this literally once again uh, covering everything about this uh, new event. So I'll leave a link to that at the end of the description. Uh, but yeah, guys, I mean, the, uh, the event looks pretty nice here. It looks a little more, um, pretty simple. Um, hopefully that the, the stuff they give you here, um, the legendary Malawan SMG is good. And uh, hope the wedding invitation uh, Jacob Sniper Rifle is a beast. Uh, that, that would definitely encourage more people to actually partake in this free event. Uh, generally, uh, Valentine's Day events and uh, video games are never like really too, too crazy. Uh, but you know, there's still something uh, before we get like a big, yeah, I think of the big content in March. So uh, yeah, once again, I'll be uh, making videos covering uh, all over uh, this event, the uh, Broken Hearts Day. Uh, but yeah, guys, just figured I'd make a quick little video talking about the Broken Hearts Day event. And yeah, guys, my name's Cree. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you guys did enjoy the video, go ahead and drop your load on that like button and subscribe if you are new. Also, while you're at it, go ahead and give that bell down there a little bit of love tap for me. I really appreciate it. Um, I also did recently open up the merch store. A uh, link uh, to the merch store will always be at the very top of the description if you guys want to go check out. Uh, so yeah, my name's Cree. Hope y'all did enjoy the video, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out, guys. You are the one, also.